Hello everyone, and welcome to Fan Requested Friday, where you guys vote on the matchup. And you guys voted for a good one. Dorian Yates, 1992. Ronnie King Coleman, 1998. If you want all of the other requests played, hit thumbs up on this video, get it up to seven or 800 likes, and we will do the remaining requests. And there are some good ones. Dorian Yates, Ronnie Coleman. Back to these two. This is their Olympia winning debuts for both of them. And I am sure Dorian Yates is set and ready to explain to us that he is in better condition and maybe that he's more muscular. The weather's not very good in England. But I'm sure Ronnie King Coleman would... hoo Boom! He turns and he, he barks. Woo! That's what he did to uh, Nasser al -Sambadi. Very intimidating. Look at the eyes on Ronnie King Coleman. Wow. Now, as we go through the shots, you may notice the 1992 repertoire of pitchers, not the best. We do have a photo shoot, and it seems to me that Ronnie Coleman, no, no uh, disrespect meant to you Dorianites, but Ronnie's making, uh, he's making him look, he's making Dorian look like a, a classic physique competitor. Now, I know I'm going to get backlash from that one, but he is, guys. Here's uh, the only real good pitcher of Dorian Yates in the front double. And it just shows the tops of the lats and the arms. And there's no way you can really judge from that. And if you do, obviously King Coleman. Yeah, buddy! Ding, 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 ding. Where's my chicken? Nom, 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 nom. Ronnie ate a lot of turkey, too. Front lats bread. And a chance for you Dorianites to get some redemption? Well... Aside from the maybe unsymmetrical ways holding his lats, I think Dorian might even uh, have met his match here in the front lat spread. But I don't know. I don't know. I do not want to ruffle. That's sacrilege. If you look at the lats themselves, Dorian is getting an edge. He is. He is. What the heck? Turn to the side and again... Is this classic physique division for Dorian Yates? Wow. Does he look puny? But, make no mistake about it, don't want to disrespect the uh, the British Bulldog. <laughs> but he does, you know, the pitchers, it's a bad pitcher. It's a bad pitcher. Ronnie King Coleman, look at him. He's a colossus. He's the greatest of all time. Now watch this. Boom. Super set man, boom. Mighty Frag, no boom. Now look. It's the other peck I know for Ronnie, but it, it's, it's, it's a bad display. It's a bad display altogether. And all of a sudden, uh, Dorian Yates' peck looks like a big man's chest. But oftentimes back in the day, Ronnie King Coleman, he would not like to hit this one. He had then this one. Then you like then this one. Yes. But, if you want to mix and match, throw up a hoo-ha. Hoo-ah! hoo -ah! This is a showdown. Now, Dorian does hold his own in the side tricep and in the hoo -ah pose position. You notice that? But other than that, blowout. Blowout. Some would argue that Dorian Yates is back. Let's take a look at the back. Some would argue that his back's better. I think he's out of his element. But of course, the Brit is not flexing his Christmas tree. Hua! There's the British hua. Now, condition of the back. Dorian is a little bit tighter in the Christmas tree. Of course, the Colossus guys. Look at the size of those glutes too. They are anything but too smooth, Monsoon. A little too smooth. So you guys would have missed that if there was no mug today. That's my face. Anyway, anyway, one mug a week. Back lat spread. And this is fair. Photo shoot versus photo shoot. Made Dorian, of course, a little taller because he is uh, straight legged. Wow, both guys very, very dry, very dominant. How can both guys be dominant? Let's have a close look at their just their backs. Keep in mind, there's no way Dorian can compete with those glutes and hamstrings of the king. Upper back. Seems to be King Coleman. Obviously the traps. A little uneven though. And Dorian's lower lat insertions. 
Maybe the center of the trap seemed to be bigger. He looks a little drier, too. Just from the back. Just from the back. Let's go to the rear double. Wow. Look. Look at the buttocks. The butterfly buttocks on uh, the king. The big king. And Dorian. I can hear you Dorianites now. Well, they weren't allowed to flex their glutes. They didn't flex their glutes. Trust me. Dorian does not have the glutes of Ronnie King Coleman. But he is matching him in the back development. To be honest with you, pie pants. I am surprised. Mmm, pie pants. <laughs> anyway. Abs and thigh, a chance for the Dorianites to get another one back. Mmm, is he? You look at the quads now. You look at the quads of King Coleman, feathered, size, he has it all. Nice obliques too. But Dorian Yates looks like a caricature from Astro Boy. You guys remember Astro Boy? Astro Boy, he is brave and gentle and wise. Oh, yeah. Most muscular, and this is most certainly... <laughs> Not a Dorian Yates pose. I mean, you can tell they're both bodybuilders. That's about it. That's about it. Look at that sunken cheek face of the Yates man. Now that it was a, a death face. But all the death faces in the world are not going to save you against this hands clasped. Nor the crab position. Look at this one. Actually, Yates looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. I think the earlier editions of the crab position were maybe his best. Looks very dry, ripped, big pecs. Not bad, not bad at all for the big Brit. Of course, when the lifter and the lorry were not in very good mood because the sun seems to be down all the time. And it's always gloomy and raining. That's what happened to Dorian Yates' magazine collection. He had a big muscle magazine collection. Would have been worth thousands. But he left it in that leaky old basement, and it's it's moldy in England. It's moldy. Only the jewels, the crown jewels, will last through the mold. Anyway, guys, all jokes aside, fan requested Friday. It's fun, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Ronnie King Coleman, obviously. 1998. Bodybuilding had it went in leaps and bounds. From 92 to 93, it went from leap to leaps to bounds. The improvement. So Ronnie King Coleman would have been uh, in a lot more trouble had he did the uh, 93 Ronnie King Coleman or Dorian Yates. And I have done that matchup too. Maybe I'll link it. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. I don't want to promise that I will. Uh, maybe I will. Anyway, guys, hit thumbs up on the video. Now more than ever, we will get all those requests in. We have a, a Phil Heath, I think Ronnie King Cole or a, a Big Rammy. I think that'd be a good matchup. You guys want to see that? All right. That's it for now. Peace.